state this planet suffers deadly storms that are contaminated by radiation from the scourge. EO's deployment was incomplete due to environmental hazards and ultimately hostile encounters. I see. Plus, no Pathfinder. If EOS is like Habitat 7, that signal we scanned must be connected with the atmosphere. We could use the outpost's antenna to track it down. Let's get the power back on. First things first, let's... Let's figure out they this murder. They in these conditions. But they didn't have a Pathfinder. They do now. We'll make Eos a home. A home. Structure up ahead. Sam? It fits the profile of a power relay station path. Find up. Right. We get it running, maybe buildings get power. And we'll know where to look for that signal. Nope. Radiation within safe levels. I can't get out there. Yeah, level three. No, I can't do that. I can't do that investigation at the moment. Power, but it's code locked. Site one issued individual security codes. Each outpost self organizes and sets its own protocol. I see. Just say we can't open it without codes. We can't open it without codes. <laughs> That's what I don't want to do. This analysis provides us with important research data, Pathfinder. If you continue to scan and collect this data, we can utilize it to develop new technologies and upgrades for equipment such as your weapons and armor. So it's the down button. I see, I see, I see. Veterinary consultant Allison May, new entry. What are you hiding, Eos? The plan, the plan, the plants exhibit sporadic hypergrowth, despite an environment that can some blast paint. So I suspect an electromagnetic trigger. I detect a signal of some kind, definitely alien. But that's not my field. Uncertain if deliberate. Vector noted. In log. Here we're scanning. No, open the door then.
main door had power, but not the interior doors? Full functionality would require an active power relay station. That means the antenna's out of power, too. The logs might tell us what's up with the power relay. Maybe. Why do you think the no pillars? People are talking here, saying that EOS isn't viable, that things aren't going like they expected. Think you should come back. I know what you're going to say. I didn't sign up. I didn't sign up for the initiative to stay trapped in a floating tin can. And I promise you can have your adventure later when they've had more time to plan for your safety. Mom told me to make sure you don't get in over your head, and that's what I'm doing. At least think about it. For me, check in more often. I've started to adopt mom's worry. Always chew, already chewed through the nail of my pinky finger. It's up to you whether I want to keep the rest, of, whether I keep the rest of my tails intact. Love you. Hello. Sorry to bug you again. Chris an update on Leah Wells a few days ago, and I haven't heard anything back. On my end, it looks like the message wasn't even opened. Is everything okay there? Get back to me as soon as you can, and tell Leah to message me back. Okay. I got a partial log, but I can't turn on the antenna. Something's blocking the power. A remote lock is active. The interference originates from a nearby power relay tower. Let's check out this relay tower. Seems good. Uh, cool. Look at this place. It's a wasteland. The radiation in Eos' atmosphere makes it difficult to cultivate life. Radiation? Our suits protect against that, right? Site 1 contains shield masts to dampen the brunt of contamination. But if we went outside Site 1's perimeter, we die pretty much that would not be advised. Yeah, I know that's not advice. I've tried. It's things. <sighs> Let's see. Everyone left was gone. Of course you did. Now shove off. Find your own salvage. This spot's taken. Who are you? So you're a salvager. Got a name? I'm Ryder. Clancy. Making an honest living by. Wait, Ryder? As in Pathfinder? The Nexus just can't let Eos go, can it? However much it fails down here. I'm tracking a signal that will help Eos. I only need power for the antenna. Look, I cut the power for a reason. The Ket are patrolling today. You turn the power relay back on, they'll know there's a juicy target alive down here. Leave the Ket to me. I take care of him. Help me with the power relay, and I'll take care of the Ket. You're crazy. Though well, maybe it's a good crazy. Okay, I'll enable the generators out there. You want to poke the tiger, it's on you. Expect trouble when we start the generators. Yep. 
There's an error in the startup sequence. Manual input required. Damn it. Please scan one of the pylons to determine a hackable input location. Generator interface possible. Location marked. Okay. go up here ah, I do I mean this takes a while generator is active Sam a French Clancy was he part of the outpost team here no pathfinder according to Nexus records he's stationed in the hangar bay so he really Ryder I think I'm going uh, on top of the ship. Where's my ship? Granted, she's a beauty, but still, it's my ship. We've got company. Where at? Directly a headshot. There's a lot of them. They weren't kidding about the cat. The power relay station is ready for activation, Pathfinder. Eh. Scan it, no. Restored. There is no way to unlock it or gain entry to these buildings. I'm working on it. Hello. You took down all those cat. Sure, use the power relay. Hell, take whatever you like. Word of advice, though, if that signal of yours is out past the perimeter, you'll need a ride. A ride? Shuttles aren't fun in these winds. You need wheels. I think they kept a little something in storage. And you didn't take it? Didn't get around to salvaging it yet? I tried. It ain't that simple. Might be easier for a Pathfinder, though. We're heading to our shuttle. Keep this up. Maybe next time we'll find more than just salvage around here. Get to a safe location, man. Go on. We'll take it from here. I guess Crazy Blue has to buy her parts from someone else. Container. What's in the container? Credits. Sure. Outpost power controls. Activate. Power restored. We should have access to everything in Site 1 now, right Sam? Correct. Plus I've located the source of the signal we detected in orbit. It's coming from the large alien structure just beyond Site 1. The structure appears almost identical to the one your father used to adjust the atmosphere on the previous planet. It's worth investigation. Not so fast, man. Let's not forget what else happened on Habitat 7. This is powerful alien tech. We need to respect it. Go slow. I admit, I'm really curious, but I hear you. A warning. Radiation levels beyond the perimeter of Site 1 are well above acceptable limits. 
You cannot proceed without additional protection. So if that structure could make a difference here, well, that would be really good. Come on. Indeed. We better find that vehicle Clancy mentioned. Okay. Now that power is restored, we can investigate the nearby buildings. Container. Looks like salvage. New. Days ago, no. Probably the guy at the relay tower. Or his friends. Cool. Special requisition all terrain scout rover. A nomad. Six wheel drive. Jump jets. Just what you need. I might be drooling a little bit. This must be what Clancy meant. The crate requires an access code from a forward station. Forward stations act as emergency resupply checkpoints. Several are currently in orbit. I can call one down. Let's find a good spot. Okay. Activating automated forward station deployment. like the forward station supplies are intact. Downloading Nomad Crate access code. Uh, contact. Present viability matrix mismatch. Habitat 1 named EOS does not match initial prefect profiles. Advanced predictive predictives are no longer applicable. Parameters require 94% rework. No one. Habitat 1 EOS discovered a trooper found a GN Garson, orbital data on board, S spectrographic profiles working, geo sounding working, radiation SF lethal out deployment alert. Fallout from sc screw from scourge is exceptionally volatile on contact with an equally aggressive decline. More data needed. Additional forward station coordinates required. Forward station network established. Initiating magnetic magne magnetospheric tomo tomography. Known. Climate. Seasonal arid. Planetary climate uniformity is unlikely to have occurred naturally. Tropos tropospheric electron dentis density has suffered manipulation. Geog geological limiters sus suspected. Scourge radiation and impact suspected. Artificial atmosphere alteration suspected. Whether climate un uniformly was intentional or product of Scrooge impact unknown. What did it need? It? Additional forward station coordination required. Ongoing text. I don't want to change my loadout. Hmm. That's a cool vehicle. I can dig it. Improve four wheel drive. Even this has upgrades. Oh my gosh. No man should handle pretty smooth. Check both forward and reverse, would you? Um, okay. Okay, I see. 
to exit radiation levels have spiked pathfinder does this mean i can do the first murder now Approaching site two, resilience. It was sold as the one we get right, but it didn't have time to get worn down. Got wiped out by cat. We'll deal with the cat, one thing at a time. Now you know I'm just going to folk. I'll do this momentarily. I want to get uh the first no, better beginning done. colonists down here everyone was so excited after all the shit the nexus had been through we finally had something to believe in then the reports came back this time will be different yeah i'm more than ready to believe again got it signals coming from that structure up ahead i see that's pretty nifty I'm picking up initiative tech nearby, from above us. I see it, up on that piece with the scaffolding. Changing position. Just picking up the research points. Let's interface with this alien device it's though. Working, but I'm just getting random symbols. Glyphs. With more glyphs to expand my database from Habitat 7, I could interface fully with the console. And hopefully start up whatever helps the atmosphere. I could provide analysis via the scanner, Pathfinder. Okay. It's working, but I'm just getting random symbols. Glyphs. With more glyphs to expand my database from Habitat 7, I could interface fully with the console. And hopefully start up whatever helps the atmosphere. I could provide analysis via the scanner, Pathfinder. Oh, I see. Oh, 
Brewery, but there's a great view! Worth carrying heavy gear up there? Guess someone thought so. I detect no additional glyphs in the area. Okay. Interface with this again. Building connection. I apologize for any discomfort. The system seems unstable. This what happened when my dad tried doing this? Your father interfaced directly with the atmosphere processor. That proved extremely hazardous. These structures could reveal its control center. Okay. The system remains unstable. Doubling our power input might accelerate the process. I'll give it a shot. Wait! Hello. Back off, or I will put you down. Calm down, she's with us, apparently. Whoa, easy. You've come this far. Just let it ride. Loot? I've been studying this tech for months. I don't know how you activated those glyphs, but you have to let them cycle through their channels. No, get off me, please. All right, time to get off. Don't like being sat on, huh? I know, I know. Who am I? I mean, it's obvious who you are. I saw the ship swoop in. You're a pathfinder. I was beginning to think the initiative just made you guys up so the rest of us wouldn't lose hope, but you're for real, huh? Yep. Uh, you think? Maybe you want to knock me down a couple more times to make sure. No, that's okay. You're obviously corporeal. Pretty solidly built, actually. Thank you. Well, look at that. The system has stabilized. I'm establishing a connection. Uh. Oh, crap. <laughs> like how casually she just said that. Like, oh man, we gotta do I this know these now. From Habitat 7. Later! Just take them out! Tangle with the remnant was a lot messier. The remnant? These monoliths, the observer and assembler bots, they're all the remnants of something much bigger. But that's too long. Ugh, I hate long. So, the remnant. Like, my name's better as PB. Good to meet you. Thanks for helping with those things. I'm Ryder. You're a mystery. I've been studying those glyphs for months, and then you arrive and poof, solved. I saw this tech clear the skies on Habitat 7. We're hoping it could do the same for EOS. Huh. Atmosphere manipulation? Maybe. Fits the model. All remnant tech is connected. You interfaced with this monolith somehow, and now it's pinging the others. I hate If you wake them up too, they must lead to whatever master switch might fix the radiation. So we follow the thread. Interface with the monoliths. Follow the connection to the source. Easy enough. Sure. Just don't piss off too many observers. Here, take my nav points. I'll be... I've got to figure this interfacing out. Just be careful. This planet's all kinds of strange. <laughs>